How long have you been involved in VIT since? My name is Alexandria Tasca and I have been at VIT since as an artist coming up on 10 years now. My partner actually introduced me to Vincent when I first came into Wellington and uh, yeah, it's become my second home. Most of uh, my artwork is based on the concept of Dharma, which is one and everything. It's the Buddhist philosophy that we are all inter interconnected and interrelated in multiple levels. I'm one of those artists that doesn't really care that, uh, you know, for, for galleries that say do not touch. I'd like my art to actually be very tactile, so you know, I'd like people to actually be able to actually just rub their fingers over and go, wow, that's not flat. Trying to explain my art to a blind person is actually very difficult, uh, but it's much easier for them if they can actually come up and actually feel the thing um, and, and get a feeling from it. Um, it, it combines um, yeah, paint technique, uh, cut to tape, signage, um, and because I do uh, quite a lot of this stuff on the computer. Um, I can generate multiple pieces of artwork very, very rapidly. So like, uh, for example, uh, this one, which is steampunk inspired, um, I have 40 to 50 variations of this that I did one night. When I'm actually taking that kind of concept um, into making the physical pieces of artwork, this is what they start ending up looking like, so I can actually do these. This is actually just a MD board and tape and pencil. Um, and and uh, paint for a whitewash. So yeah, I can actually take a piece of board like this and literally make it look like a piece of copper or, or a piece of steel uh, or a rusty piece of steel. Um, and that's actually half the fun of actually working on on the board. Um, a very big part of, of what I do with my art is me working through mental health issues. Um, as an out transgender person, Vincent's is my escape. It is a very relaxed uh, studio environment here. If Vincent's was actually able to actually be open on the weekend, I'd probably be here a weekend as well. If you're an artist and you need somewhere to go to actually work on your art uh, because you can't work at home, then definitely come to Vincent's. Uh, incredibly supportive. Uh, place for artists to, or actually learners to actually just come in, discover what they're actually good at, and find their passion.